Hello everybody, my name is Shretex and welcome back to Necromancer. So we're going to try and do a little thing to hopefully make us look more powerful this episode. So I'm going to try and recapture the city here and hopefully this time the AI will give it to me. Because <laughs> last time of course the AI was like, you don't need a city, we'll give it to this random guy and it was immediately captured and lost <laughs> in like five seconds. So I want to try and do, I want to try, let's just press the start button shall we? I want to see if we can capture a territory for myself. I'm going to store my army inside it as a garrison. And then I'm going to try and just get loads of humans to get our stewardship points up. Which will in turn, hopefully, mean that we can get ourselves loads of new army capacity. Let's do this, everybody. Let's go. Let's go. I'm kind of a bit concerned here, actually, about the enemy. What we want to do. Let's do this. Oh, he died right there. <laughs> We've got to be very careful. We can die in one hit because uh, armor is not that effective at the moment. So, oh, that's okay. That's okay. It was merely a flesh wound. Okay, let's get our guys moving forward. What I'm going to do... I'm being shot here as well. Hide in the corner, man. Hide in the corner. Wait, is that because there's a guy in there? I can't see anyone. Let's get our guys to run forward over here. Oh, there's a guy in that window there. You can see the arrow coming through the wall. Wait, literally. <laughs> it's literally going through the wall. Don't worry about it, okay? Also, there's a guy with a gun nearby as well. If we just get our guys to hide, like, here. I think around the corner of the map. Oh, be careful, game. Be careful. Hopefully they won't die. And we've got to wait for the ram to hurry up and get over here. A uh, horse. Escape, buddy. Escape. Run away. It's time to do some magic. Okay, let me just line us up. Winds of death. My favorite spell. If I just press this button. Okay, just so people see what I'm doing. I just did a spell which has like a line of effect. Which you probably already know. Oh, no. They're in a giant line. Wait for it, everybody. Wait for it. Oh, no. Well, that went pretty well. Uh, we killed a lot of them there. How many kills was that? 31. Beautiful. Okay, the main thing here is going to be, though, getting our guy out. Getting our guys. Sir, how dare you? Oh, they're over there as well. Damn it. Wait, I guess I've got to stand directly here to be safe. I guess so. We're losing a lot of troops here. Unfortunately, the, uh, the vampires have no real way of stopping anybody in sieges. They have no archers either way, so it's a bit of a problem. I'm waiting for this round to get over here, but it's taking a while. I can't fast forward, unfortunately. I just have to deal with it. Uh, let's see if I can, um... Clobber some dudes. Hoya! Nope, not too far away, too far away. Over this way. Oh, they've left anyway. They're not even there anymore. Warum's doing a great job, though. He's getting a lot of kills. Come on, Ram. Come on. You only need one guy pushing the Ram for it to go full speed. So, if we just wait a little bit longer, it should be fine. Oh! I don't know how I'm going to get that guy. I don't think I can do it. Oh no, they're over side again. We have to be in the blind spot. It's like we're breaking into like a lab or something. Hurry up, guys. I'm a bit concerned about us pushing the gate with the vampires themselves. I mean, surely that's not a good idea. <laughs> also, where's this helmet? He doesn't need a helmet. It's totally fine. Come on, guys. Hurry up. Okay, there's still some guys over there. I think we'll be fine. Who's this guy? He's very high. Is that like a witch or something? He's got a lot of armor on. I can't... S Maybe he's a skeleton. Oh, who was that? Black Knight. Oh, not anymore though. <laughs> but he had all his legs intact and everything. He should have at least lost a few arms before giving up. Oh, actually, the Black Knight is really cool with like... You can't even see their face. It's pretty terrifying. Actually, I can't see your face either. Oh, no, I can. It's very hard to see. Okay, my friends. Begin the ramming. Let's do this. I don't want to move from my safe spot, so I'm going to just stand here. Come on, guys. Do it faster. I kind of wish they did it faster if there was more of them on there, but it doesn't seem to matter. Need that. Okay, I'm going to tell my guys to break formation, and I'll bring over this way. Follow me, man. Follow me. I, would, I, I don't really think... It helps at all trying to round. I don't know how much damage this does, but if I try and help, I can't really do enough damage to even do anything. Oh, here they come. Follow me, army. Follow me. What's it take? Is it getting slower? <laughs> I feel like it's getting slower. Just open the gate game. And... We're in. Beautiful. Okay. How many guys are on the other side? Wait, we can probably just check. Let me give this. Oh, no, they've done it again. That's not a good idea, guys. Well, wins are death, everybody. Wins are death. Okay, guys. Attack the main gate. 
Go, 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 go. Gu guys? Guys, oh, what are they doing? <laughs> what are they doing? Just attack the main gate, people. It's not hard. Oh, no. I, I can pick up. Get this guy. Yes! <laughs> you think you're safe, but no one's safe from the clobber. The clobbering. Okay, we're about to break in. This should make things a lot easier for us. We can just charge through here. I'm going to run through and do a nice little... Uh... Ooh. I killed myself, but I killed loads of people. <laughs> Guys, what are you doing? Ah, they're so stupid. They should be charging through the main gate, but they don't seem to be doing it for some reason. What about now? Nope, they're still stupid. Well, never mind then. Just charge and hopefully they go through the main gate. Let's do this. They seem to be stuck on that staircase. So, oh, I'm down. Turns out, uh, if your army gets stuck and doesn't do anything, it's... Oh, they figured it out, everybody. They're going in. Okay, let's do this. We actually kind of lost the initiative here because they... Oh, that's a bit close. Luckily for us, we have this ridiculously high damage... Oh, no, never mind. <laughs> we died. Never mind. Wait, this is a very effective spear. We're doing loads of damage with this. Oh, it's a great sword, man. He's going to have like 200 HP. What the? How did that even happen? <laughs> I'm very confused by that. how that happened there. Unfortunately, with uh, spears, they're good if they're far away. But if you're attacking close, it's not going to work out very well. Oh, is this a glaive? Oh, I didn't realize. I could have... <laughs> Could have just been doing this the entire time. Well, that kind of sucks. Oh, look at that guy up there. Get them all. I still I still maintain what I said last episode, though. I wish there was more dangerous vampire weapons. Oh, he died. Ah, oh, damn it. That's okay. There's another one. <laughs> There's plenty of where that came from. I feel really weird playing as a skeleton, but it's still kind of working out. Hello there. What? How did you even kill me? <laughs> what the hell? I don't know how that happened. Wow, we lost so many units, everybody. It's absolutely insane. Yeah, I don't really feel like the vampires are designed to be sieging anything, to be honest. <laughs> maybe, they, maybe they just had to just uh, starve out the humans because they haven't got any few to worry about. Done. But it's okay though, because we killed loads of enemies, we should hopefully get ourselves some summons. Yeah, look at that, it's fine. 221 summons. Not a problem. Done. Okay. Uh, we'll take all these guys prisoner as well. Let's go inside. Because well, I don't think the sentence are ever going to last long enough to actually level up to high level anyway, which is a bit of a problem. There's a lot of um, level ups I need to go through. Okay. Oh, game faces problem. Game didn't crash. It's okay. <laughs> the game didn't crash. Now, hopefully they let me have it this time. I'm going to show Mercy again because I don't really want to damage the place I'm going to control. We're going to save in case that something goes wrong. Um, oh, Regiments of Renown. Oh, there's no one here again. Does this actually work? I don't know if actually... Uh, does that work? I have no idea. Anyway, um, we're going to hold inside, I think, for a little bit. We've got loads of guys defending on here. We're just going to wait. We're going to wait for a little bit. Actually, before we do that, let's sell the goods we have. I'm going to keep the food because, of course, as I mentioned before, I want to try and get as a human to get my uh, food up. Oh! Oh, we got too much stuff. There's just stuff everywhere. It's a big disaster. Get rid of all that. Oh, I'm losing like a thousand pounds. I don't care that much. Done. Uh, Tavern District. A witch hunter. <gasps> no, no, no. We haven't got any slots. It's fine. We'll leave them alone. <laughs> I was like, oh, what a witch hunter. Uh, let's just keep you guys... Make sure I don't get rid of them. I kind of want to keep these guys as well. We're going to try and keep some of these demigriffins to re recruit. Also, well, who turns into demigriffins? White Scarred Knights. Noble Cavalry. I don't care if we're a vampire. I want to get some of these guys, okay? <laughs> I just really want to get some griffin knights that we can just use to murder everybody. It'd be great. Um, okay. I think we'll sell the rest. We'll just get rid of them all. Loads of money. What do I even do with money at this point? I think we're just... It's, we got to the point of the game where it's, we're just too powerful. Uh, apart from the, of course, the limit with our party capacity. I'm kind of curious, because this is Empire Town, but they have better... Ooh. 
Interesting. Empire Red Line. Ooh. That's a cool armor. 100 armor, though, is way higher than anything in base game. Massively higher. I was kind of curious if there's anything I can actually use. That might be an upgrade, but I don't really think we got anything at the moment. I'm not going to get that as well, because that's going to be very heavy armor. My horse is pretty bad. I don't. There seems to be a lack of good horses in the mod. Because everything seems pretty bad. Uh, but it is what it is. It's fine. Anyway, so what we'll do now... Oh, we've got to sell some stuff. No, wait, sorry. Never mind. What we'll do now is we'll put these guys in the garrison. Actually, before I do that, let's give away the, some of the troops to my allies. Oh, won't let me do it. Game says no. Game says no. Let's leave then, and then we'll do it. I don't know why some things don't work in some situations. It's very weird. Okay, we'll give Claude loads of units that we have too much of. Oh, that's it pretty well, actually. So at least then we can keep our own units being very high. The thing on Kosomo is, do we actually have enough humans to even get myself a full party of humans? I don't think we do. Uh, Von Karsten Skeletons. Perfect. It's going to work out great, actually. Uh, three more. Done. Nice. Okay, we had to wait a little bit. Well, what we do, we'll, hide, we'll wait inside the castle. Wait a few seconds. And we'll wait until we get the, um, what's it called? The vote. The vote on who actually gets to own this place. Also, I leveled up, didn't I, in that battle? Level 18. Bear in mind, the only reason I'm leveling up so fast is because we're getting like 100 odd kills with these spells. If it was base game, because we're playing base game about Chaos Sweep Mods, it would take literally like 100 hours to get up to that level. It would take a long, long time. It would be a ridiculous amount of grinding. Not 100 hours, but it would take a very, very long period of time. Um, oh, yes. Let's get more. More speed for my party, the better. Pole arm skills have increased as well. I'm going to go with additional swing speed for sure. Two focus points. Two focus points. What do we want to spend this on? I feel like maybe... Hmm, should we just max out pole arm? Because also at the same time as well, it's a bit weird if you're playing... A, if you're playing... It kind of... The game design means that you want to be intelligent if you're a mage or a necromancer. But then if you do that, you have to also level up skills to keep leveling up. But because you are a necromancer or a, or a vampire lord, your troops don't eat food so you can't level up stewardship. And also they don't get wounded so you don't get medicine. <laughs> so it's a bit of a... Maybe they need to uh, tweak some things on either how these skills work for this mob particularly or maybe tweak some other stuff because otherwise it's really hard to level up your character. Uh, but anyway, apart from that, uh, what we're going to do... What do we want to do? Let's do leadership. We're going to be doing armies anyway. Maybe we should just go double leadership. Let's do one leadership and one pole arm. Keep that going up. Done. Okay, now we wait. Nope, that's not it. Come on, game. Give me the vote. Give me my castle. Okay, if it says no, I'm going to be very unhappy. Oh, they don't want to do it for some reason. This guy by himself has all the votes. <gasps> Yes! I have the city. Screw you, sir. Screw you. Okay, perfect. Now, we've got to be very, very, very careful with this city because we... I mentioned it, the developer mentioned a comment the other day is that they actually disabled siege defenses in this mob because there was issues with crashing and whatnot, which is understandable. But it basically means if we get attacked by a big army that's the same size as ours, we're going to lose this city without a problem. Uh, so we've got to be very cautious about that one. Uh, also, if we go to keep, go to garrison... How many humans are here? There's a few humans, but not that many. I was hoping for a lot more, because I said I want to try and get some stewardship going. So what we'll do, we just get rid of some skeletons, I think. And we'll just take every human we can for now. We're just going to try and get as many humans as possible, just so that we can try and level up our um, stewardship skills. Uh, I need them all. Give me all of them. I don't, I, I don't, I don't know if this... I presume it's either the same or less... Of an effect for the vampires. Blood dragon. Is this one of the regiments of renown? I can't tell because they look very similar to the other ones we have. Wait, um, these these ones. They have the same skills, but they seem to be different. Level forty-six. They're the, they're pretty much just. What's the difference between this guy and the other guy? 
I don't... Oh, he has a two-handed mace. That is the difference right there. We, we, there's two-handed maces for vampires? <laughs> That's what we need. Okay, anyway, let's get rid of some skeletons. Done. We'll be back for you guys later. Don't worry. We'll be back. We'll be back. Done. Okay, cool. I went pretty well. I'm going to... Let's have a look around, shall we? So I was kind of a bit concerned about stuff coming to attack us, but I think there's no armies in sight. Also, we probably should check. I don't think they would have got around to it yet, but just in case they have. Uh, is there anything new when it comes to managing a town? No. No, there's not. Do our vampire militia skeletons? I don't know. I wouldn't think they would be, would they? Uh, is there a way we can check that? Maybe go to here. Garrison of thing. Garrison. Oh, sorry. Wrong one. Militia. Empire state troops. Oh, we, we might have to wait for them to convert to our culture. Then we have a look. So it'd be cool if they, um, they just spawn in undead garrisons. And you haven't got to pay them food or anything. It'd be pretty handy. But anyway, it looks like for the most part, though, this has remained the same as base game. So, um, what is it currently doing? It's building... Oh, that's actually really... That's fine. <laughs> I'm totally fine with that. So we want to get fairgrounds and we're going to go for food because they're handy things to have. Done. Sorted. Also, my ne on the same case this goes wrong, I wanted to check this out ages ago. Because, of course, if you go to a graveyard in any town, you get criminal um, issues. They think you're a criminal because you're either annoying the vampires by taking their soldiers or you're taking the lives or the, you're taking the graves of people that live in the cities. But as this is my town... What happens? Doesn't seem anything is going wrong. Do I just get free troops? Yeah, I'll be able to get free. That's cool then. <laughs> so if you're a necromancer and you have a town, you're good to go, everybody. You just get immediately big armies. It's not a problem. Okay, cool. Uh, that went pretty well. Let's put these new troops into the garrison as well, though, because we're going to have a bit too many, I think. Yeah, I've got a little... You don't seem to get that many, though. You don't seem to get that many dudes from that situation. Anyway, uh, let's move on, shall we? So, that's, I think we've just gone a warpath, shall we? Should we just uh, destroy some dudes? With this army size, though, I want to see if I can find a enemy army, which is... not that. that's too small. <laughs> that's too small. Or... Do you know what? Screw it. Wait, he's losing. You outnumbered him three to one, man! Oh, he's got a friend anyway, it's fine. How did that even happen? That was pretty sad. <laughs> that guy just got wrecked. Okay, we're going to go over this way. We're going to just take kill the Chaos Sport, I think. I know I said I wasn't going to do it last episode, but I changed my mind, everybody. I want to see what happens if you destroy it. Wait, is this the right place, right? Um, no, it's over there. Damn it. We've gone the wrong way. <laughs> We've gone the wrong way. Wait, you can't. There's a river in the way. I was going to say, you can't go that way. I like all the farms they built and stuff as well. I, kinda, I, I like all the farms and stuff. Cult of the Illumination? Is that the Illuminati? Wait, it literally is! Wait! <laughs> They're flag! <laughs> They're everywhere! You cannot defeat the Illuminati. Okay, I think it was literally... There it is. No one's attacking my castle, luckily, so I think we're okay. Now, hopefully it let me do this with an army. If it does, we're pretty much sorted. It's good to go. I don't know if it will. There was, what, two, three hundred units there, which were Chaos Knights, so they're stronger than what our guys are. Let's wait till the morning, and we're going to go in. We're going to destroy this portal. Surely it's a bit unfair attacking with a... Are you serious? Are you seriously going to attack me with, like, that many gas? <laughs> Seems like a terrible idea, friend. Okay. It does... It's letting me do it. Oh. Ooh. Oh, I guess we just, uh, I guess we just <laughs> do this battle then. Uh, let's get my guys ready. I love the choke points, by the way. Wait. Oh, could you imagine? I love it. Oh, if I get my arm there, just shoot down with my uh, archers. Oh, we haven't got any archers. Yeah, yeah we do. Sorry. <laughs> the game's still broken. Look, I can't fix it. It's just like, it thinks these are horse archers for some reason. I have no idea why. It's completely mad. Oh, it's because there's two archer formations. This used to be, it's still broken nevertheless. It's fine. Anyway. Get ready, guys. Now, they've only spawned with half the number. Should we? I'm not going to use any magic. We're just going to use the power of the skeleton hall to win this battle, okay? Well, unless we lose, then I'll use the magic then. My my skeletons. 
my friends. Look how many we have. That's awesome. A lot of them are just level one, unfortunately, though. Something that I would absolutely love, by the way, if it's possible in the future, is that if you, you know, you have skill books and stuff in Necromancy and whatnot, maybe have like a specialization or like some kind of, um, like path you can choose, like a sanctuary with spells. So I like it as well, because I understand at the moment you have, um, influence increases your, oh, here they come, here they come. Get ready, man, get ready! Oh, no. That was fine. That's, that's fine. Oh, frick! What are you doing? <laughs> Frick! Go and stand in front of everybody else. You're, you're too dangerous to- He's killing everybody! <laughs> they killed 120 allies in the first five seconds. Cavalry, go and stand in the front. You're you're too dangerous. Stand at the front. Don't come near us. Fire spells that way. Franz! Oh no. Well, we've lost a third of our army, everybody, from just ourselves. And now you guys aren't doing any attacks. That's just disappointing. I'm not going <laughs> to Damn it, guys. Pull back, pull back. Okay, army of the undead. Advance. Oh, you did that time, though. We're going in. We're going in. Anyway, so what I was talking about, I'll probably briefly end what I was talking about. We call if there was like a passive skill tree or like a tank tree you can use to necromancy. So I would love it if I can, for instance... Have a thing so I spawn higher level skeletons every time we win a battle instead of just spawning low level ones. Because like, oh, right now I mentioned you guys mentioned in the forms that you were going to get more and more um, like loads and loads of troop levels, like low like dick smacks of them. That'd be kind of annoying for this faction because they all kind of suck. <laughs> so it means you never get high level units with this faction. You must be careful. Okay, screw this. I'm going to go in on foot. Cavalry start attacking as well. Uh, inventory archers. I mean, go over the side. Let's go and kill some chaos. I got this. Wait, are these different ones from before? Chaos Chosen. Did we see these last time? Oh, they are tanky. I shouldn't be surprised. They literally look like they're space marines. So, oh, chaos marines in this situation. Back off, sir. Back off. So, they, I think they have like uh, more reinforced coming. I'm just going to run in and try and kill them all. It's really weird playing this game and there's just like dudes with this super armor. What was one? I thought it was an ally. Get him, get, wait, is it an ally? No, it's not, it's not. We lost so many skeletons though. Okay, it's looking pretty cool. Oh, Wolverine's doing some good old friendly fire again. Good job, buddy. Leave no one behind. <laughs> or alive, sorry, in this situation. We're about to do it. This guy is very tanky. But he unfortunately, he got his lance out on the ground. Not a good idea. <laughs> good job, everybody. Good job. I feel like this is definitely going to be a loss for us in terms of troops. But, I mean, we killed the Chaos Portal, so... Ooh. Wait. Come back later. Oh, it's like a... Is it come back? Cool. What have I got? Dragon Tooth. <gasps> it's a two-handed... Wait. Wait, 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 everybody. These swords are additional weapons of a letter clowns. But what does it do? <laughs> but, okay, I feel like... If it's a magical sword... I feel like at this point of the game, I have to be true to myself, and that is going to be using two-handed sword. Wait a second. Can I get free magic staffs and have 30% increase in buff? Does that work that way? <laughs> I'll just get loads of random magical equipment and just do that. Anyway, I for sure am going to be using this magical item myself. Yes, I want a gigantic sword. Yes, thank you very much. Um, awesome. I'll definitely take that. So, I wonder if this means that they come back at some point in the future then. Hopefully it will. And is this the only Chaos Portal in the game? Are there more? I'm trying to look at the map quickly, see if we can, like, eye spot any around and about. But I don't think there'll be more at this point of time. But, still, pretty cool though, pretty cool. I really want to chart on somebody. Can we fight some dudes? Uh, maybe we do, like, a... Um... Oh, are we getting attacked by somebody? 
declares war on us. I thought we were already at war with every human. We are at war with everybody, by the way. <laughs> the humans are not a fan for some reason. I have no idea why. Okay, let's see what we want to do then. So I feel like we should take over some... Let's go back to my base, which is all the way over here. Let's go for this uh, castle over here. It's this city, sorry. Also, I'm pretty impressed. It seems like the uh, Necromancers have a really, really low cohesion loss. Or maybe it's because of the amount of units I got on my army. I'm not really sure. But still, it's pretty nice. You haven't got to worry about cohesion every five seconds. Also, have I leveled up again? I have. Ooh. Uh, let's go for more XP per day. Um, yeah, we'll go for the low XP. Another alternative that I was just thinking about when I was walking around. It was working, by the way. We're getting sure shit points. Very handy. Another alternative that I was thinking that might be a good idea as well. Uh, ooh, yes. Yes. Discard armors can get XP. That could be very handy. Another alternative as well. that Maybe you have like a um, a magic capacity like for necromancers when you win a battle. And you have like, oh, you can get... I don't know, like a hundred necromancy points worth of units. So you can choose if you want higher tier units or go for like swarm units. Because I don't know how it works in the lore with Warhammer. Do you do you, the skeletons get better at fighting? Or are they spawned in as a grave guard? Are they that tier of unit or do they actually have to get better over time? That's what I'm not sure about. Anyway, so we have the ability now to discard armors, which is a base game thing, which gives us experience. Which we're going to try and use right now to get ourselves a bunch of level ups. Which kind of works, but not that well. They nerfed it quite a lot, so it's not as useful as it used to be, that's for sure. Done. So those are really weak lords everywhere these days. <laughs> I guess they are. Maybe they just can't get the units because they're really using territory, maybe? Anyway, let's go over here. I feel like this should be a vampire place anyway, because it's literally like in a, in a swamp with like stuff around it, surely. Oh, nice. This place is now uh, a vampire place. Has the militia changed? Say, oh, so the militia troops are humans. Oh, wrong button. Oh, no. There's no oh, I really want to get some regiments of renown. We, who are they anyway? Uh, Death Jacks. Let's have a look at Death Jacks, shall we? Oh, there they are. Death Jack. Uh, they're longbowmen. With a pretty okay bow, I guess. I don't really feel like these guys are that powerful. <laughs> but really, anybody that's got a bow in, in, in Banner Lord is going to be powerful than most units. So, uh, yeah, it'll still work out. Okay. Though, if there's, a, if there's a universe with guns, I feel like I would just use the guns. Up my way. Okay. 576 dudes in here. We probably want to get some backup just in case. Let's call some new dudes to help us out. Oh, this guy. Yeah, because with the Vampire also, their army capacity is insane. <laughs> we can get massive armies really quickly. Okay. Done. Uh, let's see. Also, what, what I was on about earlier with my uh, idea about like passive skill trees and stuff for Necromancers. Have one that increases the uh, capacity of units. Oh. That's my city. How dare they. Yeah, that's my city. That's definitely my city. Okay, where are they? We got this. This is fine. We have an advantage on this one. We're going to go in, everybody. You fools! So it's a warning, though. Now it's going. No! Yes! <laughs> it's Derek Von Bite. He's got this under control. Okay, let's do this. Are we ready, men? Okay, we're going to learn my lessons from last time. Cavalry, follow me. You guys cannot be trusted to be anywhere nearby my allies, okay? You're going to follow me. We're going to do some early uh, magic on the enemy. I'm keeping my eye on you guys. We've got an ally as well. He's, he's probably going to lose, though. He's just going to run forward and die horribly. Okay, uh, let's have a look. Hopefully they stop moving so we can do some spells on them quicker. But we'll have to see. Oh, also my sword, isn't it? Wait, double hand. Yes. It's glowing. It's got little, like, stuff coming out of it. Let's do a nice little man attack, I think. Oh, that was beautiful. Oh, okay, guys. Fire the magic. Fire the magic. They hit themselves. <laughs> oh, I feel so bad. Okay, just stand here, guys. Just stand here. 
Oh no, it's not going looking good for them. You actually don't, you don't really want to use two-handed swords on a, a horseback because you actually got less range than using it one-handed. Okay, pull back, pull back. Oh no, back. Oh no. How many guys to be killed, by the way? 87, respectable. I'll do one, we're gonna start bringing the infantry in as well for the horde. That should be quite a few kills as well. Oh, you got killed by my friend. I, oh no. Okay, cavalry, it's wherever you are attack. I don't really wanna play as a witch because there's nothing unique about them. Let's go and play as Van the Vampire, the most amazing vampire. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, good. We should be okay at this point. We got a lot of damage in them. We probably just charge through. What's your weapon, Van? Oh, it's the axe. I need to switch this out, don't I? I didn't like it that much. There you go. Okay. I'm surprised I got to sit there. Oh, no. That was a bit stupid. Where's the main army, guys? I probably shouldn't have been wasting my cavalry like that. It's, you guys, pull back. Shouldn't there's not like a magic one you can do, like a magic, magic formation? You have the mages there. So I want to call keep the cavalry alive because they're more powerful than these guys, but... We're going to go in. I'm going to fight on foot as well. Oh no! I forgot. <laughs> I forgot about the jumping! Damn it! Well, that wasn't really what happened there, but it's okay. we got to try and keep pushing them back. We just keep going forward, guys. Keep going forward. Oh, that didn't really work out that well. Um, uh oh, uh oh. Okay, it's fine. <laughs> just get to their main unit and start charging, guys. Luckily for us, they haven't really used the uh, range units that well here. So, go, charge, charge, charge. Nice. Okay, let's do this. I'm probably going to die very quickly because I took a lot of damage from those lances. Let's be careful that guy. Nice job, everybody. Swarm them to destruction. Ooh, we're getting some hard damage here. Oh, no, I'm so sorry. Yeah, get him, guys. Get him. Ooh, we're taking some hits. I want to kill you, sir. I got on my arm. It's fine. It's fine. Okay. That guy doesn't even care. He's like, I must go this way. It's very important. Oh, why not? Oh, I keep jumping to hit the guy easier than I keep jumping over everybody. <laughs> the downside of being a gigantic um, squat man. The vampires do so many squats, we just can't jump normally anymore. We just fly up into the universe. Oh, double head hit. Double decapitation. Beautiful. Where am I? I'm here. Oh, I don't think that works out well. <laughs> I think there's maybe some side issues with that one. Um, keep swarming, everybody. Keep swarming. I got 119 kills, by the way. <laughs> That's pretty crazy. If they stop and shoot right now, I'm just going to die horribly. It's going to be a complete disaster. Come on. Come on. Come on. Wait, should I jump? Yeah. No! Oh, I was hoping to like get one in the face or something. Oh. Where are they going by the way? It's like we've left the oven on. Everybody has left the oven on at the same time. It's a big disaster. So your skills are very good at blocking. Oh, don't. Game, game. Don't crash game. Oh, that was a bit scary. I always get terrified every time the game that spawns units in. It's a very scary situation. Where Are they running away from the battle? Oh, no! It's okay, it's okay. Oh, it's not dead. Oh, 
Oh, that was a bit close there. Oh, they've decided to actually fight us now. Okay, let's do this. I'm probably going to get a shot in, like, a few seconds. Okay, the horse arrived. <laughs> There's so many skeletons. What are you guys doing? <laughs> they, do they even know that themselves? They seem very confused. Well, this guy's like... Oh, this guy's like a badass. I'm done. I'm like, ah. Oh. I saw the guy behind me. I was like, oh, we're doomed. Oh, he got away. Not that it matters, because you can't really escape in these situation in Bad Lord. You just vanish from the game itself. So they're dead anyway. <laughs> In the old game, uh, in Warband, when they used to escape from battle, you used to create a separate army of routed units that used to escape. It was pretty cool. When they used to go into, like, cities and then go back in the army and stuff. Um, yes, my name is Frank. Good job, Von Bitten. I feel like you... Why are you... A, should this guy be a vampire? I feel like he should be a vampire. <gasps> I thought for a second that we recruited, like, a hundred or whatever... Uh, like 300 chaos knights <laughs> but anyway we get some more dudes i presume these guys are people so they probably should eat food but i don't i don't know i don't know i presume they're not going to be regular humans but at least they should have some kind of like monetary uh sorry hunger values i, I presume um we'll take everybody again no we we're not gonna we won't take everybody we'll just take a few skeletons okay uh take all prisoners all the ones that we can take done Ooh, I did turn this down earlier, but I feel like this gets this gets a better armor. Let's see how it goes. Also, this is pretty awesome if you ask me, and it's also free as well, which is pretty handy. Done. That went pretty well. We stopped the enemy attack. Beautiful. I think we've got enough time to go and do another siege, and we can just push forward from there. Uh, let's get ourselves. Oh, this. I don't think I'll be able to recruit them anyway, because these are clearly going to be empire units. They're not vampire ones at all. So I doubt that you'll. I don't know. Maybe. I doubt that we'll be able to actually recruit dudes that are. Um, sorry, units that are empire base. Uh, it'd be weird if you, you're a human, you go and recruit all the vampire lords, wouldn't it? Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Okay, we're gonna get rid of those guys, and we're gonna keep the rest of it for myself. Oh, uh, prisoners, prisoners, prisoners. Uh, I, yes, I want to keep most of those guys. Should we just try and keep all this cavalry? <laughs> I really want to get the cavalry, guys. So we get, let's get rid of those guys. Done. Okay, uh, let's head over the side this way. And let's try to go for this battle here. I think we're doing pretty well, though, when it comes to moving forward. I feel like we're making some good progress here and taking over the map and stuff. So it's pretty handy. Uh, okay, done. Also, let's check, because I, the uh, one of the developers responded last episode about my confusion about this, the level up thing. Ooh, wait a second. Franz is now adept as well. So he didn't actually know why this was happening. <laughs> Fan is like forever doomed to be like a, an entry level necromancer guy. But that's fine. Uh, sorry, uh, magician. But it's okay, because if, at least if Franz and Wolverine level up, we can give them some powerful spells and stuff. Like one of them has great already so yeah this is working out pretty well i'm not sure that actually dictates leveling up though but um who really knows at this point who really knows it's totally fine chaos raiders is raiding oh they're attacking my villagers yeah let's get ourselves a ram and then we're going to go in okay i'm trying to look around as well i feel like we kind of killed mostly i thought like the humans are respawning quite slowly so maybe it's more like a situation where you are meant to lose a lot as a vampires, but you kind of like slowly grind them down with the power of um, the power of just being able to get units out of nowhere, pretty much. You just immediately get loads of men. Okay, everybody, this map may have a few issues. That's why we're starting with the actual in combat screen instead of going for the loading screen again. <laughs> this is actually going to be the fifth time I tried this battle, everybody. Um, half the time to crash. The other half times there was a horrific game bug. Uh, where my troops just couldn't climb ladders, couldn't attack the gate, and it was awful. <laughs> it was absolutely awful. We'll try again, though. I'm pretty sure this is a base game map, so the issues are probably going to be with the base game, I would say, in this situation. Well, apart from... Sorry, let me... See. Half the times the game crashed, that probably is not going to be the bait. That's going to be the mod. But the other half, it was... I think all tail was with their uh, infinite AI abilities there. So let me just get my guys to move over quickly. We're going to do... Everyone go and hide over here. Everyone hide in the corner. 
So as we have absolutely no archers whatsoever, we've got to try and hide our units away. To show you what I meant, by the way, um, if I go over here... Oh, no, I can't show you yet. Never mind. Well, I'll talk about it anyway. So let's do some quick magic in case this is the video that goes into the video. You never know. Uh, let's do some Windsor magic. Take this. Nice. 38. Not bad. Not bad. I did a way more before, though. So these ladders don't seem to work properly. Only one of them actually seems to be climbable. The other side, they don't work at all. <laughs> And for some reason, when the gate gets opened up eventually, I can't get my guys to actually attack the gate. It's just, it just thinks it's outside the map or something. It's really weird. So, um, yeah, this is not looking too good at the moment. we got to wait a little bit of time anyway for this guy to get close. So what we'll do, we'll just run around like this. I'm going to heal myself anyway. And I'll just keep spawning uh, Winds of Death inside. Ooh, Wolverham! Wolverham! 42! You can't show me up like this, Wolverham. He's still going! <laughs> 55 kills! Damn, boy! He's doing a great job. He's doing a brilliant job. Yeah, so what we, we keep trying to do wins of death to so keep the air numbers down. Let's do another one right now, actually. Because luckily we can attack through this gate and just destroy people, so. Nice. Who's winning now, Wolverham? Who's winning now? I am. Not you, me. <laughs> uh, okay. Where's the, the Rams there? A little bit more time. Yeah, because we've got to bear in mind here, our units are absolutely awful at combat. So hopefully we can get in and get like a big swarm going. If we don't get the swarm going, we're screwed. So the reason I was having trouble the last two times I had to just... I lost because of the weird game mechanics. Because I can't attack with my main army in the main gate. We, they separate out on the ladders. They get stuck down here, die, and I can't win. It's impossible. <laughs> so it's just like, ah! <laughs> Bit of a problem there. How many guys have we killed so far? 165. So we nearly kill... Nearly... What, 500? Yeah, we're, we're getting pretty close to the halfway, actually. Let's do this now, we're right now. 201. We've nearly killed, at least, I would say, like, I don't know, 30% of them. We just have to hope this ram can get close enough. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no, God. That was a bit close. Okay, guys, it's not working out, is it? It's not working out. We seem to be too far away for these guys to actually use the ram here. Uh, can we just have like a little formation like... Like this? I think that'll work. Let's see if that works. Because of course, the closer these guys are to the um, ram, the quicker they reinforce it. Oh no, I got hit, direct hit, direct hit. <laughs> to be fair, my character is actually useless now anyway, because I've got my magic. So, uh, But I want to try the sword anyway. Should I just help? I'm going to screw it. I'm going to help. <laughs> Let's speed things up. Let's go for the ram. I don't care about my life anymore. We're pushing forward. I don't care. I don't care because I know a secret, everybody. This map has a boon. I was waiting for somebody to kill me, but they're not doing it. Guys, just finish me off, please. <laughs> Hit me! Hit me! Hit me! Damn it. Why could I do it this way anyway? Uh, let's go and play. Wait, let's not do it while I'm doing this in case it crashes the game. Uh, let's go. Where's Van? Where is Van? Van, you have a plan. Now that they, uh, now the Ram's here, we have an ability, everybody. Yes. Yes, you can do it. You can do it on this. Oh, it didn't work. <laughs> damn it. I was pressing the button, but it just didn't work out there. Okay, let's try again. There you go. Oh, damn it. I did it before. I know it's possible. Hello there. I tried it. Hello there again. Unfortunately, Van has an axe, which isn't great, but it's fine. Um... Nope. Oh, that's bad. This is bad. This is bad. Get inside, bad. Get no, 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 no. Wait, why are they dead? Oh, did my spell attack like all? Oh, we're dead. We're dead. There's no way. There's no way. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, wait. I could just open the gate that way. Genius. <gasps> yes, it's working. It's working. This last time, I, it had this. It had this on the gate. And I couldn't get him to attack because we can attack in one location. We might be okay. Can I, get back, can I get back up there? But yeah! Nah, won't let me. Can I jump inside here? Nope, won't let me either. Okay, I'm going back upstairs. You guys tap the gate, okay? Going back in. Oh. 
Where am I? Hiya! If I go in here. Oh, don't work, don't work, don't work. Pain, pain! No! <laughs> Please! No! Ah, oh, damn it. This is too. Frick just killed everybody! Frick, you just killed half our army! Why didn't you use the spell earlier, man? What are you doing? What are you doing? Okay, we're inside, we're inside. Perfect. It's working out, it's working out. We're fine. Oh dear. They're kidding. Dude, use your spells at the start of the battle when you were like outside, like Wolven did. We just lost most of our army to our own units there. That was a bit of a problem. Uh, this scythe isn't very good either. Uh, why do the vampire weapons suck so much? <laughs> There are some side issues with the vampire weapons. I blocked it just in time. There you go, that works. We're doing some good damage here though, doing some good damage. We've lost a lot of men though, unfortunately, but we still have a thousand to go. We should be okay. Just through the sheer numbers of our units, we could probably push through this. We are, of course, a Swarm faction anyway, so... <gasps> Give me that! That will work! That will work! This will work! Let's do this. I said this will work! Let me, let me hit you! Okay, perfect. Perfect! So even though we killed a third of their force we even going in the base, we still lost loads of troops there. If we didn't have magic, we probably wouldn't have won this. I was even with 1,700 troops. The uh, skeletons have a lot of troubles when it comes... The uh, vampires have a lot of trouble when it comes to sieges, I think. Unless they've got enough magicians, I guess, and they can just push through that way. Good job, everybody. Good job. Try and get this guy out. Oh. Oh. Parkour. Wait, how do you reckon I can like explore the map with the parkour? No, because they put magic walls everywhere, didn't they? Yeah, tell what us other thing with magic walls. I bet right now if I do this, there's gonna be a magic wall here. No! <gasps> we can explore! There's only, well, only until we win the battle. Oh, we actually can. Ooh. Do you know what? Is this a Bandalore map? Or is this a mod map? I don't know if I've seen this in base game. Okay, if this is a mod map, you guys need to check your ladders, okay? Because it doesn't work very well. <laughs> There's some issues with the ladders, trust me. Okay, are we done here? It might be though, I don't think I've done every single map in the game, but I, I can't, I don't know. I'm just stuck in now, aren't I? I'm just stuck. <laughs> oh no. Yeah, this must be a mod map because Tailwells puts magic walls everywhere. Guys, have we not, what, what are you guys doing? Where's the remaining enemy? Oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Oh no, oh no. <laughs> Okay, I think there's a glitch enemy inside a wall or something. Where are you guys going? Um, maybe, maybe not. Oh no, they actually are. He's actually escaping. He's like, I got this. Don't worry. Freedom. And he's too. Personally, I would just leave the city instead of going into the keep. Oh, could we treat you to keep? So, we're going to have to... Oh no. I'm going to save. Can I save? Thank you. Whew. How's this going to work? Because if I auto resolve, we'll lose all the troops we can get from the victory. So, um, I'll just watch the battle from up here. They just ignored every... Oh, they have... Get him, get him! Whoa, the camera's wild, everybody. The camera's wild. I keep going up. Luckily, the game's auto set to do all these blood knights, so they can just absolutely murder everything. Nice. Hey, what are we? Oh, yeah, guys, I'm out of here. Screw this. I'm leaving. Hopefully, we can win. 
Luckily for us, they haven't given the mission maces. Oh no. Oh no. Kill this man, he has a mace! Oh, okay, it's an axe, it's fine. Axes aren't a problem. I don't want to be up here again! <laughs> Damn it! Double mace, be careful guys, be careful! Yeah, they got him, they got him. Not a problem, that guy. Are we done here? It is mad seeing Blood Knights get killed by just regular units though. <laughs> Yay, we did it! Oh dear. Oh no. So, because it was a keep battle, it reset the death counter, so we didn't actually get anything from that. That's pretty mad. But to be fair, it's, it's fine. Don't worry about it. It's, it's Don't worry about it. It's fine. It's fine. It's not a problem. Okay. Done. Okay, everybody. I think we're probably going to wrap up the video right now. So, i got a question, everybody, for everyone, because uh, I feel like at this point, unless I've complete... I've got an error message. Don't crash the game. The game's fine. Good. I got an error. Uh, so at this point of the series, we've kind of done everything. I feel like I don't think I've missed off any mod related features for this series at this point. I don't think we've done anything. Or I, don't, I think we've done everything at this point for this uh, Necromancer series, at least in terms of content for this faction. I don't think there's anything else we can try and do for these guys. So I'm going to do a poll. This is coming up tomorrow, so it'll be Friday. I'm going to do a poll on Friday to see if the people want me to try and, uh, like, wrap up the series on Saturday and do, like, an Empire series with the guns and stuff to check that out because uh, I feel like at this point, uh, now that we've seen all the magic and stuff, we're going to edge into this base game, which is going to be just sieges. <laughs> As you tell by that, I'm not very excited about that one, but, um, yeah, because I feel like we've done through the mod content, the Necromancer's faction has a bit of an issue when it comes to doing sieges and stuff anyway. And I feel like we kind of see everything. So I'm interested, if people wanted me to do like an Empire series and we just go through the features of that. Like, so I know you can do artillery, we can check out the Griffin Knights, we can check out all the gun units and stuff like that. Or should we try on playing Necromancer a little bit? Because i got to say, at this point, we've kind of done everything that's, like I said, unique. So it'd just be us going around and attacking uh, castles and cities and stuff, which I don't think is going to be that interesting, personally. Um, but that's what we do a poll about. We'll see what people want to see. Because uh, I, I, I mentioned before, I, did, I, like, I like mods. I like the mods, so they change the game. Um, though, after you do the features, you get back to the base game, which is, I still have a problem with, which is, like, the base game, mid and late game is not very interesting. So uh, let me know what you guys think. We'll do a poll and we'll see where we go from there. Because uh, otherwise, we yeah, that's why, we, that's why I do community polls, though, so we can find people's views. Because I know what my views on the situation are, but I don't know what your guys' situation, uh, views on the situation is. So, apart from that, everyone, I uh, hope that everyone has enjoyed today's video. As always, please like, subscribe, and comment below, and I'll see you next time. Bye.